We think gospel nonviolence needs to be a conversation that goes on every day, throughout the day, for any Christian. Where the world is saturated with violence, it's filled with violence, and it's filled even worse with justified violence. Most of us in the Catholic Church have lived under the umbrella of a just war teaching, and it's been in force ever since uh, the 300s. To talk about the nonviolence is what's different. It's part of the Catholic worker movement it is just one example. But we know very clearly from the Gospels that Jesus did not teach a just war. And it's only when we start the conversation about why that's not the way of Jesus and how we can live without that being the way um, that our children are going to be able to live out and imagine and other options. Original Christianity is nonviolent Christianity. So our curriculum is, a, is just about that. It's work for the children. It's um, somewhat meditative work, but definitely work for the hands that the children can um, go, so the children can go deeper into that truth of Jesus' nonviolent way. Our curriculum starts with a foundational story. So we talk about God being unconditional love, and that um, God is love, and that God gave us Jesus, the model to follow, and through the disciples, and then through time, that golden thread of nonviolent love is in existence. And then we introduce children to people who follow closely Jesus' teaching on nonviolent love. People like Dorothy Day people like Origin, people like um, Menno Simons. With our selection of individuals here, we're trying to say that there's a wealth of individuals who belong to this nonviolent tradition. These are some people known and, and not so well known, but any person can be a part of this golden thread by the thoughts, words, and deeds that are uh, reflective of nonviolence. We'd also spend time, um, for example, uh, making, we call it making an icon, gluing a print, an icon print in place after sanding and painting the wood and learning how to meditate so that the children can build a relationship with the nonviolent one, Jesus. They're seen in the manipulatives, in the card material, uh, resonates with experiences in their daily life. Mm -hmm.